All right, guys, we got this. Let's go. Good white trip speed. Control X, go. On one, on one. Ready? All right. What's up, guys? It's Pick'em with Huddle GG, and in this video, we're going to be talking about the ability known as Set Feet Lead. This is going to be an ability we will equip on our quarterback, and passers with this ability have increased throw power on bullet precision passes made while their feet are set, except on high or low ball throws. Okay, two important things with that definition. One, it does need to be a bullet pass, so we can't use this ability for touch or lob passes. And two, our feet do have to be set when making the throw. So if you're rolling out or scrambling when trying to throw the ball, this ability is not going to work as intended. Okay, this ability is going to allow us to make throws into much tighter windows. And that's going to be the best time to use it and the best way to use this ability as well is when that cornerback or that defensive back is closing and we need to get the ball out to our receiver quicker so that defensive back can't make a play on the ball. Okay, in this video, in practice mode here, we're going to be using two quarterbacks to demonstrate how great this ability can be and how useful it can be. And we're going to be using Lamar Jackson, who has 93 throw power, but he does not have the set feet lead ability. And then we're going to be using Tom Brady, who has a slightly lower throw power rating of 92, but he does have the set feet lead ability. Okay, now we're going to be making the same throw to the right of screen here, this out route to Godwin. All right, so first we're going to use Lamar Jackson. So we see the break and we throw it, and you see how the ball floats in there, right? The ball does not have any zip or any velocity to it, really. Now, this is a bullet pass that we threw, okay? So we say hike here, and you see, we see the break, and we throw it. We have some separation when we throw it, right? There's a good couple yards of separation there, but the ball floats in there. It allows the defensive back to make a break on the ball. If it's a good user, they're going to take it back for six on you, okay? Now, if we just simply sub Tom Brady in and make this same exact throw, you're going to see that this ability itself is going to make this such an easier throw for you. Okay, so again, we're still looking to that out route. We see the break. And you see there, when we make that throw, the ball zips in there. It has a lot more velocity to it, and it is going to get to our receiver quicker so the defensive back cannot make a play on it. Right, so again, we throw it on the break, same as we did with Lamar but the ball does not float in there, so it does allow us to get that ball to the receiver before the defensive back is able to make a play on the ball. Now, you can see the vast difference this can make in those two throws here in practice mode, but here are a couple of clips in game action to show the consistency there as well. All right, so in this first video, we're gonna be throwing an out route to the left against off-man coverage, and this is without set feet lead, and you're gonna see that it allows the defender to undercut that route and get that pick six simply because we have no velocity on that throw. Now in this second clip, we are going to be throwing the out route to the right side, and it's not the best read, but you'll see here with set feet lead, it's going to allow us to fit the ball in there right before the defender can get there simply because of the velocity we're able to put on the ball. Now this is with the same quarterback, so nothing has changed there. In these next two clips, we're going to go over a crossing route over the middle. First one's going to be without set feet lead, you're going to see how the ball just lobs in there and it allows the user to make a play on that. Now we do get lucky and catch it, but you can see on the second play here, uh, we do have set feet lead, same exact route, same exact coverage, and we're just able to fit it in before the user can even make a play on the ball simply because of that ability. Hopefully this video helps you have a better understanding of set feet lead, and for more Madden tips, make sure you check out all of the free content on our YouTube channel. Have a blessed day.